back again with mentalist and illusionist Wayne Hoffman and of course my lovely daughter Josie. What do you have for us this time? This one is an impossibility in its truest form involving something you probably have never seen, a deck of what? playing cards. You know what? That is increasingly becoming a weird thing for people to encounter. Like yeah. you and I grew up, like this is how you met other people was Isn't playing it? cards. <laughs> it's yeah. nuts because people they'll say, oh, the two of clovers or a black three of diamonds. Is this are you guilty of this? Yes, yeah. I am yeah. guilty yeah. of what this. Are these, uh, what are the, these? What are these? The one that board. looks like a, a, a puppy foot. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So uh, we're gonna do a little experiment involving the two black aces here. We are gonna see if you have- Clubs. <laughs> okay, thank you. Spades. <laughs> yeah, thank just you. in case you were wondering. Clubs and spades. So, yeah. we are gonna try an experiment to see how lucky you are. Do you, do you feel lucky? No. <laughs> <laughs> you have to feel lucky to be lucky. It is a self-fulfilling prophecy. Oh, okay. So, keep that in mind. So, we're gonna try an experiment. We're gonna give these a mix, and I'm going to count the cards down like this. Whenever you want, you're gonna yell stop, and we're gonna insert one of the aces there. Okay. So, you yell stop whenever you like. Stop. Right there. Are you there. sure? Do you wanna go back one, forward one, or right there? Now that you say I'm not, if I'm sure, now I'm a little... It go is one, important. One more, one more. One more? Yeah. No, go back. I trust go my back. opinion. There we go. We got it. <laughs> what are you You're trying good? to psych him out? What is going on here? All, All right. right. All right. We're going to put the ace right where you marked it. We're going to do it again. We're going to insert that one. So same thing as I go through, yell stop. Stop. I right trust there? my opinion right there. No questions asked. No All right. Questions. You were confident there. Now you agree that you yelled stop. We shuffled the cards in the beginning. I believe if a person is lucky enough, they are able to insert the black aces right next to the matching red aces. So we are gonna see how close you got. Now, <clears throat> yes. Those would be hearts and diamonds. Thank you. <laughs> I just, didn't just, know that I'm here to help, shapes. I'm here to help. Oh my okay, gosh. Yeah, right. Thank you. So <laughs> the odds are astronomical. Let's see how well you did. Let's have a look here. Check this out. <gasps> right next to each other. Boom, you nailed that one. What? Literally right next to it. And let's go through. Look at this. Boom, what? two for two, right next to the red aces. You're, right. You're great. I had to believe in myself Exactly. To be lucky. Super lucky. Wow. You are lucky, I knew it. Wow. So congratulations. Now you just need to go just be buy lucky. a Powerball ticket. I wish we sweet. had credits so we could just roll credits right <laughs> yeah, now. Like, that's super lucky, that's it. <laughs> yeah, that's just how we end it. I'm gonna guess that there's more to the story here. Josie, talk it out. What does your magician brain say was happening? Well, I was thinking maybe they they were stuck together, the cards, and held mm. them really tight. Pretty good. But actually, something. that's a magician brain right there. That That, that is, is. That, that is, is. That is. That is not maybe, the case. Maybe a little bit less magician brain. <laughs> yeah. Less? Do you know how this works? I, uh, I have a guess. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> That was a good guess, though. I mean, hey, I, yeah, I'm surprised you went that route. That was like really, yeah. that's like high-level magician. Like a, yeah. Well, I mean, it seemed like a Die Vern and crossover yeah. with Ed Marlowe <laughs> with a little bit of a... Maybe when you were putting them down, you snuck it right when... You snuck it. You snuck it in you there, snuck right? It. <laughs> this is like when somebody's like, I know how you did that. And you're like, how did I do it? And they're like, you did something tricky when I wasn't looking. <laughs> I'm like, well, you're not wrong. Yeah, it's so that's funny. what I did. Do you know how many times I've heard that in my life? You did something tricky. Well, so what is the tricky thing for this one? Yeah, there? it's pretty cool because you can even put a semi-genuine shuffle in the beginning as a convincer here. So here's the setup. This is how you do it. First and foremost, you are going to take two of the aces. It doesn't matter, red, black. Take two of them and you sandwich them on the outside of the pack. So you have one on top, one on the bottom. So they're in this configuration here. That's your setup. Now, you obviously wanna take the black aces out. Here's the cool part. If you practice this, if you shuffle them and just drop that ace first, right. and drop that ace last, they're still in the same setup. You're still gonna have the ace on the bottom and the ace on the top. You just have to be mindful that when you shuffle, you can do it a few times, drop that one down, and then drop that one last on top. And again, you remain in that same situation. Of course, if you're an advanced cardist, you could do you know a million and one different cuts and all that, <laughs> keeping him in the same position. But again, the simple version, you're gonna just shuffle, drop that card on the bottom first, keep shuffling, and drop the top one, keeping it there like that. Now, once you're still in this position with the two aces on the top and the bottom, 
you begin to count. Now that drops that ace here on the table. So it's now on the table, and now she can truly say stop whenever she wants. As you yell stop, oh. okay, you're gonna yell stop, let's say here. Remember, this ace is here. So once I put it in, I'm actually putting this ace next to it, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, when I do it again, we're set up with this ace on the bottom. So as I go through, okay, these that ace is still here. You're gonna go through and you're gonna yell stop at any random location. When we put the ace in and complete the cut again, you're putting that ace next to the other one. So now the aces are right next to each other. And when you give them the, the fabulous spread, you'll see you have these two next to each other here and these two next to each other. So there. I assume there's some limit to how far you go the second time. Before when... you get to the end of the deck. Right, yes. right, right, yeah. <laughs> Which most people do, and you know, you wanna pace yourself, and you don't have to go extremely fast. And most people <laughs> will get bored if you go extremely slow, so they'll say stop eventually. So you, you know the question that. now, Josie. Can you do this trick for us? I do think I can do this. Ah, this we'll is... see. I have faith. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Are you feeling lucky? Yes, I do feel lucky because I understand. Okay, all right, well here. There's one on top, right? Yep. And there's one on bottom. Yeah. Perfect. And then you can pretend to shuffle it. Wait, hold on. Yeah, you got it. As long as they stay in the same configuration. So okay. you'll drop your oh, right sweetie. hand first. <laughs> Don't make fun of, I can't shuffle. I, oh yeah, uh, it's a work in progress. Yeah, it's a work in progress. You really should know how to shuffle. It's a good shuffle. table shuffle though. That's very, Bloop. that's good. Now shuffle some of these off. Bloop. Yep, there you go. And just end with that left hand on that top. That one Done. on there you top. Go. See? And then, out of the gate. Perfect. Out of the gate. Perfect. And it was like a professional casino shuffle. That was advanced. How, yeah. how did I turn into the jerk here? <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank Uncle you. Uncle Wayne is taking care of her. <laughs> so you perfect. did that great. That was that was perfect first yes. time in. And then I start like doing Individually, yep. yep. Yes. Okay. Yell when to stop. Make stop. I told you to yell. Don't you have to yell. That was okay? a test. That was a test? To see if you would stop, even though I didn't yell. I'm just that respectful, okay? <laughs> I... <laughs> it's not me, for me to judge. I don't, I don't live in the household, so. <laughs> All right. And then I put it here. Great, yep. And then I put this on top. Yep, you got it. And then I do it again, because now the ace is on the bottom. Bingo. So bloop, bloop. Make sure you say bloop, bloop, or it <laughs> yeah. won't work. It it's won't massively work. important. Exactly. Yell went to staff. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Ah! <laughs> okay. <laughs> it was me yelling. Yeah, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Boom. And, and then, your work is done. Yeah. Was that, that easy? Great Are job. Are you lucky or unlucky? I, I don't know. I have you for a daughter. That's, oh, that's, that's, that's good luck, for sure. <laughs> I'm, again, Uncle Wayne I'm being trying, the good yeah. guy I'm here. I'm trying to be the good Ew, guy. You are, you are. Okay. Can you find them? There you go. Um, Boom, <laughs> and drum roll, please. Wait, hold on, I gotta find. Oh, Vanishing there aces. There okay, there, there, there you go. Yeah. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> awesome, well done. All right, Wayne, where should we go to see more of your stuff? Oh, I'm easy to find on the interwebs. If you search Wayne Hoffman, you'll find me, or you go to waynehoffman.com. There's links to the YouTube channel, the social media, and all other fun things available there. Heck yeah. Yay. That's good, <laughs> nicely done.